So, movie sequels titles. Now, sometimes sequel titles can be crappy. They don't make any sense. I mean, some of them do, but what the freak? No, 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 no. all the sequels I'm about to show you as the titles. Just because the titles are bad doesn't mean the movies are bad. Okay, some of the movies I'm showing you that the titles are bad. The movies are pretty good, but here are some of the worst titles of all time. And why I think they should just keep on numbering them. So, let's begin. This journey begins off with a franchise called Predator. This franchise is known for this big bulky guy that's an alien and kills everyone with his cool weapons. That guy right there. He takes off his mask and when I first saw this, I was terrified. Yeah. Yeah. In the movie, the first one, called Predator, made in 1987, the title works. Predator 2, okay, yeah, you just number them, because there's no one else to call in 1990. Predator 3, oh, wait, wait, what? No, it's called, it's called Predators. This movie is supposed to be called Predator 3. It's supposed to be the third entry to the franchise, except it's called Predators. And I heard there's going to be a new one coming out this year called The Predator. Predator 4 won't hurt, alright? You won't get sick like I am right now, sorry. You won't get sick like I am if you just call it Predator 3 or Predator 4. Well, probably because, I mean, there's more than one Predator, but come on. Just, just. Our next entry to a franchise comes with a franchise called Jaws. Alright, you know what the deal is. Jaws, Jaws 2, fine. Jaws 3D. Okay. Jaws 3D is fine with me. I mean, it has the word 3 in it, so it's fine. Some people call it salt. I mean, bleh, thought it. Jaws 3. Jaws 3D, it, it's fine. Because, I mean, the movie's made in 3D, so it's just telling you 3D. Uh-oh. Jaws the Revenge. Nostalgia critic called it Jaws 4 the Revenge. I call it Jaws the Revenge. Many movies, DVDs, Blu-rays, and complete collections call this movie Jaws the Revenge. The movie is not even good either. It, it, it doesn't make any sense. And who the heck made Jaws PG-13? Jaws was supposed to be PG and family friendly. So, basically, Jaws was ever family friendly. I get that it was violent it had some language in it, but... It was PG because... Kid, kids know what violence is. Okay. Let me calm down. Alright, so now I just got that out of my system. Let's know. Hold on. Terminator. Okay, this is just already bad. Terminator Genesis. Terminator. The Terminator. Okay, Terminator 2. Judgment Day. Okay, you're just taking D out. So, Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Okay, those work. Terminator Salvation. Terminator 4, Salvation. Terminator 5, Genesis. What were they thinking? What the frick were they thinking? Holy crap. They don't need to just call it. It doesn't need to just be a, a subtitle. Alright? It doesn't need to just be a subtitle. One second. Alright? Yeah, it, it doesn't need to just be a subtitle. Just saying. Uh, okay. Oh, wait. We still have, like, hold on a second. We still have eight freaking franchises to freaking look at. Paranormal Activity is a franchise we're looking at next. <sighs> Paranormal Activity, okay. Paranormal Activity 2, fine. Paranormal Activity 3, Paranormal Activity 4. Alright, fine. Paranormal Activity, the marked ones. Would it hurt to just call Paranormal Activity 5 the marked ones? Paranormal Activity 6 the Ghost Dimension. Instead, they just call it Paranormal Activity the Ghost Dimension. When did they start just unnumbering them? You, you can't just not un. You just can't not number them. Alright? There is no reason to do that. Jeez. Alright. Now we're not looking at horror anymore. I mean, Terminator is not really horror, but some people call it horror. But yeah. Next, we're looking at a Batman franchise. None of these movies have numbers. Batman, okay, Batman Returns. Batman Forever. Batman and Robin, okay, that works. That's how it works, but that movie's not really good. But that's how it works. 
because it's Batman and Robin. <coughs> Batman Begins, The Dark Knight, and Dark Knight Rises. Look at this. Dude, there's no, there's no numbers. There's no, I mean, I get they're rebooting it, and I get the first title, but he's not, I don't get it. They're supposed to be sequels, not freaking making it its own franchise. I mean, I get that the Dark Knight franchise is making it its own franchise, but what the freak? Okay. Oh, here we go. This makes no freaking sense. The Final Destination franchise. Okay. Final Destination, Final Destination 2, Final Destination 3. Those sounds work. Oh, okay, there's, there's Final Destination 4. Wait, no, it's called The Final Destination. And after that, it's called Final Destination 5. It's called Final Destination 5. Final Destination 5! After a movie called The Final Destination. These movies aren't even good anyways. Like, the first three were great. Then, The Final Destination came in, and when I first heard about this, I was like, okay, it's too early to reboot a franchise like this. And I was like, oh, if I... it's called Final Destination 4? At the end of Final Destination 5, it, called, it was called The Final Destination 4. Final Destination 4, and look, look at this cover. That, that's the cover of Final Destination 4. Of the, I, I'm sorry, The Final Destination. Look, look, see, that looks creepy. Look, and you just take that out. And then you just put the right there, and it's called the Final Destination. That that's the cover right there, and that cover looks great. <sighs> Freaking failures! Ah. <laughs> They're really bad at naming stuff. Hey, have you seen the movie called The Final Destination? I was like, okay, yeah, yeah, that 2000 movie. No, I'm not talking about the movie 2009. Wait, whoa, which one's first? Which one's first? That, that's what you're gonna think. Which one was okay? Unless you do a little research. Alien. Okay, this franchise has a lot of problems with it. So there's Alien. Okay, fine. Aliens. Okay. I feel like I have to get like I feel like I have to get onto this time because I mean I got on the Predators, but there's probably like more than one Predator. So how about just race Predator? Because I mean Predator's a good sequel. I mean, come on. It's it's not a great sequel, it's just the title, man. But I mean it's just the plot. And plus, I mean, come on, Pred I mean, Predator, Aliens, that, that, that makes sense because, you know, the title and stuff. Um, then there's Alien 3, okay, that works because, I mean, there's nothing else to call it. And then there's Alien Resurrection, there's more than one alien, so why do you call it Alien instead of Aliens Resurrection? Just call it Alien 2. Aliens 2 Resurrection to start a whole line of sequels. And there's Prometheus, which I I don't really know is the same in, in the old original series, so. Yeah, but then there's Alien Covenant. Why do you have to call it Alien Covenant? Just why? Just saying. Here's the next one. The Friday the 13th franchise. Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th Part 2 and Friday the 13th Part 3. Okay, it does work. Final, no, Friday the 13th, the final chapter. Some people call it Friday the 13th part four, the final chapter. No, every DVD says Friday the 13th, the final chapter. Why? Friday the 13th Part 5, New Beginning, Friday the 13th Part 6, Jason Lives, Friday the 13th Part 7, New Blood, Friday the 13th Part 8, Jason Takes Man. Those titles work. Jason Goes to Hell, The Final Friday. Jason X. Why? Just call it Friday the 13th Part 10, Jason Goes to Space. Friday the 13th Part 9, Jason Goes to Hell. Why do you have to just stop numbering them? And then there's Freddy vs. Jason, that works because you know it's a crossover. And then there's a remake, that works too. That's how it works. <sighs> Nightmare on Elm Street. The first five had numbers Nightmare on Elm Street, Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge, Nightmare on Elm Street 3, Dream Warriors, Nightmare on Elm Street 4, The Dream Master, Nightmare on Elm Street 5, The Dream Child. Okay, those work. <coughs> uh oh. Freddy. It's dead. The final nightmare. I get why they call it Wes Craven's New Nightmare in the 7th one. Because, you know, it's just like, basically, um, you know, 
the uh my, my head hurts. It's basically just you know that's the plot. But Freddy's dead. The final. This call Nightmare on Elm Street six. Freddy's dead. Why do you stop numbering things like this? Of course, over it, it works. Um. Uh. The remake also works because you know. Something wrong with that. Uh. Oh, here we go. The Mummy. Every. Mo okay, so the original classic mummies. I mean, I'm not mad at those. I'm talking about the 1999 version. Come on, what the freak? Mummy, Mummy Returns. Okay, I'm gonna say that works. Actually, no, not really. Just call it The Mummy 2, The Return of the Mummy. And then they call it The Mummy, Tomb of the Dragon Emperor. The one person just call it The Mummy 3, The Tomb of the Dragon Emperor. What the freak were they thinking? You shouldn't just. I mean, people aren't gonna know which is which if you don't number them. Our last franchise we're gonna look at is called The Evil Dead. Okay, The Evil Dead. The Evil Dead 2, Dead by Dawn. Alright, uh, those two work. Army of Darkness. What, what, what's the Army of Darkness? Okay, oh, I get it. It's Evil Dead 3, Army of Darkness. Okay, yeah, it wouldn't hurt to just call it that. You could just call it Arm. You could just call it Evil Dead 3, Army of Darkness. You can't just call it Army of Darkness. You don't even know what it is. If I'm in a book, and I'm just talking to every horror movie I know in your order, and people are going to be like, oh, what's Army of Darkness is about? I was like, oh, it's Evil Dead 3. I'm like, why did this start number one? They're changing the titles. Yeah, and the remake voice, because you know. So, I got angered a lot. Angered a lot. And hopefully you subscribe to my channel, because my channel is freaking awesome. Um, yeah. There's other channels I want you to subscribe to, too. It's called Panda Paradise. You know, stuff like uh, Gianni and Giorgio Vlogs. Subscribe to them. Subscribe to a lot of people I know. Um, yeah. So... I'll see you later. Also, join the Nova Zayson squad. And do me like this.